got you. Welcome to another right. edition of the Mark Ballot Show. I got a very special guest. His return visit. His name is LP Marcy. Tell the world what's up, kid. What's up? What's up, man? It's your boy LP Marcy, man. Mr. Lemon Proof. You know what it is, man. Shout out to Mr. Mark Ballard. Shout out to the whole Pack 14. Thank you for having me today. Appreciate you coming back, man. Um, so what's been up with you, man? Man, what ain't been up with me, man? Life. Life dealing with adversities, you know, but I'm trying, you know, overcome these situations right now for what it's worth. Yeah. Save my career. I just hope all is well at the end of the road, you know what I mean? Because you definitely on the road. You definitely going straight forward. You doing big major things, man. Shout outs to Davies and his movement and everything. And, um... Mr. LP, how's that merch doing, man? I like that shirt you have on, man. I appreciate it, man. That's the new LP Chrome Edition. I got a few colors, black and white, a few sizes. I mean, tight, man. Y'all know how to reach me at all my socials. Mm -hmm. uh, the merch been going good. It's still growing, but mm -hmm. due to my legal circumstances right now, I'm forbidden from traveling how I need to. So, Hercules. you know, I got to make the best of the situation. And, do the best I can do at home. Right. But home really don't rap with me like that. So it's like, you know, I'm making the best of it. It's kind of hard, I bet you. Yeah, it's cool, though. Shout out to those that do support me, though. Man. Appreciate y'all. You still making music? Oh, yeah. I got some new joints ready to drop. Mm-hmm. Probably mm -hmm. about to drop two tapes on the same day. Any features or just you? Wow. It's you put in work. Yeah. Solo I, artists. <laughs> yeah, I ain't been really like seeking features. Like, it's a couple people I am gonna get mm -hmm. some songs in with, but mm -hmm. right now, it's all about you know picking up the pieces. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm picking the ball up and, and taking it as far as I can, why I can. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Because yeah, tomorrow ain't forcing it. You might can wake up dead, or you can might wake up going to jail. So mm -hmm. it's like. I'm just making the best of it. Yeah, you just got to figure out a way to get away from all that other stuff. Only thing you need to do is just concentrate on getting your brand well heard and everything. You know what I mean? So that's that's my opinion. But um, what can we talk about as far as your brand and um, what's your next move? Well, I just tapped in with this new graphic designer. So I got some new merch coming. Mm-hmm. I got my own uh, strain coming too, my own marijuana strain coming. Oh word! Yeah, shout out to them EGM boys, man. All my guys up New York, they, you know, the whole Shibuki team. I got a strain called Shibuki coming soon. Whew, that's like the truth. So, <laughs> what it is like? One of my A&Rs, you mm. know what I'm saying? His brother got his own smoke shop and license business already. He got mm -hmm. a few of them. Mm -hmm. So what we're going to do is bring Shibuki out here, but he's the licensed manager for it. Mm. And we're trying to open up our own smoke shops. But if that all, all that fails, we're trying to have Shibuki at all the stores that's like licensed to, you know, have a recreational marijuana there for sale and stuff like that. Mm. So, yeah, we, we were selling Shibuki with a tax on it. Okay. That's what's <laughs> up. Um... Any no events coming up, man. By the time y'all see this, I don't know if I'm a been done this event by then or not, but I will be performing at the Unity Fest. Mm. Feel me? If I already did, by the time y'all see this, how did y'all like my performance? Did I look good up there? Did I still got it? You know what I'm saying? Y'all hear where's, that motion? Where's Uni Unity Fest located? Where in Cambridge, Maryland. In Cambridge? Hmm. It's Mass on the 29th. Out to Cambridge, man. Everybody doing their thing out there in, in, in Worcester County. Yeah, LK, I mean, Dorchester up, County. Yikes! Yeah. I got it wrong. Yo, Dorchester, <laughs> Groove City, and all that. Yeah, shout out to my man, LK. LK, peace. Pause it real quick. I got to take this call. Yo. Yo. Yeah, yeah, man. Y'all be on the lookout for that shit. Book you sold, man. Shout out Uncle Luke and the Gumbo brand, man. Because, like, they really motivated. Like, I learned a lot, like, traveling, you know, mm -hmm. and meeting new people and stuff like that, my music and everything. So it's like, I really sat down and like got schooled by a lot of greats that mm -hmm. our city and our area, like the people that everybody be like glorifying and worshiping and all their platforms and every day is like, 
some of these people is the ones I actually know mm-hmm. personally. You get what I'm saying? Like I really sat and talked to them like this, then went here with them and did that with them. Mm-hmm. So it's like, you know, the the part where it's dealing with like the consciousness of like the business and expanding, mm-hmm. that'd be the main focus point because at the end of the day I'm still meeting them as an upcoming artist, mm-hmm. regardless of the platform that East gave me. You get what I'm saying? So who who is your who who do you listen to when you don't listen to yourself? I listen to honestly, I listen to well of course the East, I listen to Kaz, mm-hmm. I listen to Vezo. Bayface, Ray, Louie, um, Rob49, YTB Fat. Yeah, Lil' YTB Fat. Yo, he he, he's, 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 yeah, yeah. 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 OT7 Kwani. Kwani yeah. from Philly and my man Skrilla. My doggy dog. Yeah, speaking of Philly, man, condolences to Gilly's son, man. Yeah, man. That's, that's crazy. That's crazy, but. <laughs> Mad condolences, you know, to to the fam- him and the family in the state of Philadelphia, man. Pray for Philly, man. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And pray for, the the balance, pray for all the major cities. Pray for all the cities, all the cities and towns in between, and all that, man. Because uh, it's a it, they try, we they trying to change the narrative of like letting the babies get into the the the, the situations out here, and it's crazy. It's, it's my just my heart just go out to everybody, man. Yeah, it's been definitely some crazy stuff going on out here in this world, man. All over the world, not even just our city. Like, mm-hmm. y'all gotta start paying attention to that news if y'all not watching that news. Watch the world news. There's so much going on in life right now that like a lot of y'all is like blinded. A lot of people is really blinded to the truth of what's going on in the real world. You get what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. It's like a double society out here. Like, you got the society that we see as a whole, and then you got the society that's behind the scenes. You get what I'm mm-hmm. saying? That's controlling the, the, the algorithms and and, and, and the, the tempo of the music. And mm-hmm. it's just, it, it's a lot to get into. If you're really interested, look into that type of stuff and t- look and see what's messing the world up. Because the world is messed up, mm-hmm. you know? Like, I got a couple beat people, right? Like, people that be making my beats and stuff, mm-hmm. producers. Like, dudes being like, one was like in Slovakia. Mm. Another one was in like France. Mm-hmm. Another one in Canada, I'd be like, shit. When they went, excuse me, I'd be like, shoot. Cut. I'm gonna go back in. Nah, I'm gonna just go back. I'd be like, I got, I got the uh, beat man, you feel me? Canada. Slovakia, stuff like that. And when I talk to them, feel me, I be like, yo, go outside or mm-hmm. take a picture and let me see what it look like out there because I ain't never been. But I just want to see how, like, their demographics is over there. Mm-hmm. Like, yo, it's beautiful, like, especially at nighttime in France. Mm-hmm. <sighs> Man, it's beautiful, you bro. You a chance to go, too. It's beautiful. Yeah, I got my passport and all oh, that. Oh, man. Feel me? If I ain't had this... Legal situation right now, I've been with East and Canada right now on tour. Mm-hmm. Shout out to East too, Piff. I mean, we did this interview today on Loco Birthday, man. Happy birthday, cuz. You know the vibes. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Um, Mad shout outs to everybody who's listening and watching the Mark Ballard Show, Pack 14, Rap Fiend Radio. You can look at most of my interviews, all my interviews on YouTube if you're trying to just uh, tune in and check me out. Um, a lot of lot of positive things is going on in the community, man. Let's just try to keep that pinpointed and focused on that only. You know what I mean? And uh, that's what the Mark Ballard Show is all about. We're here to uplift the community and give people positive information of what's going on where we live at and all surrounding areas, and plus around the world too as well. Brother, uh, so uh, seven yeah, 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 most definitely. Uh, uh, um, any shout outs? Man, shout out to my kids. You know what I'm saying, you know, my son ready to be born, Mozzie. Mm. You know, so I'm looking forward to that. Thank you. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to my family, my grandma, my mom. You know what I'm saying, everybody believing me for real, like my little brother. You know. 
All the supporters, it's like, man. Yeah, all the supporters, all the fans, all the haters, you feel me? All promo is good promo, whether it's good or bad. Everybody entitled to their own opinion. Opinion does not outweigh a fact any day, any time, any way, you feel me? So, like, don't be opinionized by things you see or what people say. Be yourself. Mm-hmm. Always be, be yourself. Be living proof, man. Never let your adversities become reality. Follow me on Instagram, LP underscore Marcy. All my platforms, LP Marcy, that's LP M A R C Y. Follow the brand, Living Proof Apparel. Shout out Uncle Mark Ballard, man. Free the guys, uh. Free the guys, man. Moment of silence for everybody we lost 2023 thus far. I'm saying, I'm gonna give it back to you, Uncle Mark. Um, uh, you can reach me at the Mark Ballard Show at gmail.com. If y'all want to contact me, have a special interview. Um, those who's doing entrepreneurship and those who's doing good for the community to do wonderful things for the people. Uh, that's what we focus on. Um, I think we're going to wrap this up, man. Um, One thing. What's up? Excuse me, not to cut you off. You know, me being an artist and from this area and stuff like that and doing so much for the community, the homeless people and things of that nature, then to unexpectedly, you know, run into a situation, a legal situation, whereas you go from, I go from being this public figure, a positive peer in the community, doing X, Y, and Z, to the people that know me, compared to a person that done locked me up, typed some papers up, and now I'm a menace or I'm a danger, I'm this, I'm that. Like, it's a lot of bias within this judicial system all over the world that needs to be paid attention to because certain things that goes on is very biased and injustice, but it's not a lot of voices speaking on that. Mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? It's unfortunate I got my little brother and, you know, my cousin, you know, I can't really speak on so much, but my brother never been in trouble a day in his life, but how they carried him with the whole situation, they made it seem as if he been getting in trouble for so long. It's no way no man should be held with no bail or anything like that, or bail used as a punishment with violation of Eighth Amendment mm. when you never been in trouble never before. Never been in trouble. Whereas though y'all let somebody out that done did the most or got caught with this, got caught with that, and they get locked straight up and go straight back home. Yeah, yeah. Yet, when it comes to politics and the politicals and the behind the scenes talks of the music scene, I'm the type of got everybody discussing, feel me, with all the negativity, yet I'm the one that go through so much because I feel as though the ones that's speaking on all the negativity is the ones that's really doing all this. You know what I'm saying? Because mm-hmm. how I move and how I operate, I stay persistent, but I stay within. Mm-hmm. So for a situation to happen to me like that after everything that I done just been through and these transitions with my music and stuff, mm-hmm. it had to be somebody that was near me because nobody knew certain things mm-hmm. that led up to the situation, like the location. Mm-hmm. I was coming back from Texas. That's all I can really say. I came back from Texas. I was only home for a couple of days. Bam, this happened. A lot of people didn't even know I was back. So for them to know I was back and to know where I was at, that has to come from within. Which makes me say, keep your back door closed. And no matter how far you get in life, sometimes it's best to separate yourself and see your own vision for what it is because everybody don't got your best interest at heart. Like, yeah, keep watch the company you keep. Man, don't be in denial. Like that was always my my downfall. Like being in denial of certain things that was in front of me, but I would be in denial about it because it's like I couldn't believe it. But you know, when you don't believe, it'll show you. Mm-hmm. It'll be, when you don't believe something happened to make you believe. So mm-hmm. don't ever be in doubt. Like if you feel that, you see that. Hey, go about it like you're supposed to because mm-hmm. you could almost lose everything like I did. Mm-hmm. Now I'm saying, hey, trying to pick the pieces up.
But I thank y'all viewers out there for tuning tuning in with us today. Y'all stay tapped, man. Y'all stay blessed, man. LP Marcy. And um, y'all stay tuned for the next edition of the Mark Ballard Show with special guests on the way. Uh, y'all stay encouraging one another and stay prayed up. You already know what it is out here in this wicked world. We got to stay prayed up out here. So, everybody, see you next time. Peace and blessings. <clears throat> yeah.